Hi there, Fran Brown here from Fran Brown Pilates. Um, I'm going to demonstrate today our squatting technique. Um, now squatting um, is a very, very good exercise. It strengthens uh, the legs, it strengthens the buttock muscles, of course, which strengthen your back, um, strengthens your upper body, your moving, strengthens your knees. It's a brilliant exercise to do. Again, you don't need any equipment. Um, but the technique is very, very important because we want to protect our back when we're doing this, we want to protect our knees, um, don't want any pain going in the wrong area. So how I demonstrate this in my classes, first of all, um, is by using a, a chair. Um, now we've done our three points of connection, as in uh, ears in line with the shoulders, hips, etc. So when we go down into our squatting, we need to keep that position rather than going forwards like that. We need to keep that position and then that protects our back. Shoulder blades back and down, abdominals in. That takes all the strain from the lower back as we're, we're sitting, standing, or even um, if we were picking up something, it's exactly the same technique. Um, and what we have to watch as well is the knee alignment. If you repeatedly pick up, drop, or um, do movements where your knees are constantly further forwards than your toes. Um, it can put pressure on the knees and cause problems years later. So what I want you to do, if you grab a chair, standing nice and tall, breathe in, breathe out, abdominals in as usual. Now we're going to sit back on the chair without the knees and the thighs moving forwards. Okay, and we keep our shoulder blades back and down, chin retracted. So we're sitting down into this position. Breathing in, breathing out, abdominals in, and then we come back up the same way. Shoulder base back and down. Do not let the knees and the thighs move at all. Breathing in, breathing out, abdominals, sitting back, shoulder base back and down, chin retracted, and the same thing coming up. So if you're just starting out with this, um, you can do this with a chair just behind you, just in case uh, you're not quite sure. Okay, so when you've got that, then we can go um, into our squatting um, in a bit more detail. So with Pilates, again, we've got our abdominals, we've got our buttock muscles. We can add a little bit more tension in the legs to work harder. So what I want you to do, pelvic floor, breathe in, breathe out. Abdominals in, buttock muscles first, we're going down into our squatting technique. Any back issues, any knee issues, it doesn't matter. You can keep the movement really small, or we can go down a little bit lower, making sure your hips don't go down below your knees, not safe for your, for your knees. But what I want you to do on the way back up, okay, breathe in, breathing out, abdominal, squeeze the buttock muscles, push the feet into the floor and squeeze the legs as you come back up. So you're getting a really good strengthening workout in the legs as well. Coming down, breathe in, breathe out, squeeze, and coming back up. As I said, you can make it a tiny movement. Breathing in, breathing out, abdominals, shoulder blades, chin retracted. Breathing in, breathing out, and coming up, feet and energy into the floor. Um, now again, we can add a couple of different things in here to make it a little bit more challenging. And if you add something with the upper body, it helps to focus a little bit more um, on those shoulder blades. So I quite like sometimes to use the exercise ball. Uh, exactly the same thing. There and coming up. Uh, you can squeeze it with the palm of the hand. Give you a little bit more workout in the core and the upper body. Uh, we can use, again, our light weights. Again, gives more focus on the shoulder blades and obviously works the lower half uh, a little bit more as well. So breathing in, breathing out abdominals, three points of connection, squeeze the buttock muscles first, tension in the legs, down you go, breathe in, breathe out again, push the feet into the floor as you come back up. Okay, if you want to work harder, again, you can take the arms up a little bit higher. You can speed it up a little bit, okay, but don't lose your Pilates connection, your three points of connection, your abdominals, your energy into the floor. Uh, finally, um, I quite like to do this exercise sometimes with this little thing. It's called a fitness circle. Uh, again, I add these into a lot of my exercises. 
Um, so you, you place the palm of the hand on the soft bit, breathing in, breathing out, going back, squeezing and coming back up. Great for the arms, great for the chest. Helps you to focus on the shoulder blades as well. Breathing in, breathing out. Okay, so that's your basic squatting technique. Um, I'm going to be doing another um, video on squatting a little bit more advanced. Um, but if you give that a practice first and then take that into your everyday activities. So if you're picking something up off the floor, remember, don't let your shoulder blades collapse. The strain goes into the lower back. Make sure you're doing it correctly. Or if you're sitting down on the chair and coming up again, make sure you're doing it with the proper control. OK, well, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Please like and share. Uh, leave me any comments and if there are any exercises you'd like me to go over, um, just ask. Okay, bye for now. Thank you.